Hello everyone and welcome to Papa's Cluckeria to Go, the second mobile exclusive Papa's game. This one's been a long time in the making, it's kind of been like my white whale of the Papa's games. But look, we can see the food before it's cooked! But let's get going, we've got Wylan B. Wylan B. We have Olivia, and we have the custom worker who has also been waiting a while. His name is Lance. Mooney. And Lance Mooney is kind of based on all those edgy anime characters that you might have seen, but I'm specifically thinking of the main guy from the Trapped trilogy of games. I did a video on them, these Flash games, and the main guy had this very kind of overacted edgy anime protagonist voice. He's like, why do I feel so trapped? So that's the kind of thing I want to do. I'm not going to make him look exactly like that guy did. The Mooney part though specifically comes from the idea of moon logic puzzles, which those trapped games very much had. That's puzzles that are ridiculous and don't really make any sense. I can't say I'm a fan of this chicken outfit. I want him to be not too tall, actually. I kind of like him being a little shorty. Little short king. All right, we're, we're ready. Lance Mooney, Papa's secret project. What could this possibly be? Oh, do we already know? Oh, it's a job fair. Okay, I was going to say, do we know each other? Oh yeah, me and Papa, we go way back. We were trapped together. No, but it was a job fair. Okay, he's at the job fair. And we can go and work in Oilseed Springs at the Cluckeria. Look, there's tons of chickens already there. We just have to catch them. Yord Popcorn Cabin. Zero competition, it says. Sounds great. But three weeks later, here we are at the Cluckeria, and it's very, uh, <laughs> very obvious with the branding. And there's the secret Papa recipe. There is no secret ingredient. Oh no, the chicken sandwich war start in small town. This guy with a robot. And then we got these two with futuristic new coop. And then we got, oh my god, demons. Bonnie and Yolanda. And then there's me, Lance Mooney. Look at these freaks. They got nothing on me. Papa's like, I see how I'm out of here. <laughs> I'm gone. Uh, leaving us to fend for ourselves as usual. Anyway, this is the fry station. This is the build station. This is the slush station. Yeah. Okay. And here comes Ember, and you want something fiery, I assume. Oh, by the way, if my voice sounds a little odd, it's because I'm still recovering from a cold. But this video cannot wait any longer. It's been delayed long enough. All right, so we have the order ticket here. And yes, she wants the bee. She wants the blazing hot, spicy Cajun batter. Uh huh. And then we gotta drag the actual piece of chicken get it right in the middle that's obviously gonna be a thing they're gonna knock me down on and then we we get it I, well I think I put it on that one my good man but okay put it there if you want and then we got all these toppings and we have drink it's another game with a drink station because sometimes you need a fourth station and you don't know what to do stick a drink on it this time it's slushies but here we are look we've got the thing and we're back to our drag and drop interface bloop there's the bun and then we switch to get to the meats. Here it is, look, so all our meats will get stored here. Careful not to get confused between them. And then we go back and we just gotta do the toppings, like this one. I like spicy food too, it makes me feel alive for once. And then we gotta go back to the bun. Back to the bun. Anyway, now we gotta do the slush. Tangerine slush. Oh, that wasn't... Skip training? Well, I would like to, because that wasn't- that was no good at all. I'll just have to deal with it, I guess. Better show the whole training. It'd be weird if we just skip it. Oh, that was very nice. That was right on the edge. Just gonna slush it up, mix it up, blend it up. Yes, this is like the third time I've attempted this. The first time, on the other emulator I was using, well, that crashes all the time now, so I can't use it. The second time, I tried it on mobile, and I hated it. The third time, we switched to a new emulator, and it's much better. But everyone looks a bit crispy for some reason, just like the chicken. Oh well. It's good enough. Hey, and that was pretty good. Only lost 2%. It's Fudini himself. What are you doing here, Fudini? You shouldn't... You're not meant to be here so early. Look at him smiling away. What a menace. We've got Papa Juice. We've got to do it in Papa Juice. Smear it in papa juice. A papa smear, if you like. So is this a veggie burger, maybe? Don't know. Anyway, look, we can go over to here and start this off with the croissant. And then we got some absolute insanity going on the top of this. What is this? What is it? A flaming berry? Well, that doesn't make any sense at all. Of course, Fudini would order something that doesn't even exist. 
Oh, we got a perfect on the first day. I mean, it's the easiest day to get a perfect on, I suppose, but that's pretty good because now the pressure's off. I've shown that I am capable of getting a perfect. Fudini felt like he was going to be nice today, I guess. He probably just tosses a coin, rolls a dice, I don't know, does something to decide if he's going to be in a good mood or a bad mood. It's all about chance. Whoa, da 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 da. Want to play? Yeah. Of course I want to play. I love Rico's chili works. I love seeing chili get spat out of a pipe. It's all pretty easy. It's not much to think about. I don't know what these later ones are like. I haven't got far enough yet. Oh, ingredients. Okay, let's have a look. What is this? Blazebury sauce. That does... That, that's... You made that up? There's no such thing as a Blazebury. Okay, did you get that from the magical land that Papa supposedly went to? I think it was all just a ruse. It's all a conspiracy. Oh, a large cup, very exciting. Yes, it is a veggie patty type. Meat alternative, mm-hmm. Yeah, alternative my ass. Let's take this stupid chicken thing off. Let's take this off. There we go, let your hair, your beautiful hair flow free, Lance. And uh, I think the tie kind of works. I think that makes sense. It's kind of like um, that persona stuff, you know? And we ought to look at the shop as well. Let's just look at the upgrade shop for the time being. We've got the fryer boosters, the doorbell, the fryer alarms, six of them, the slush boosters and slush alarms, and a coupon, and a special sign. Let's continue though. Let's see what we got on day two. Alberto, crispy Alberto, and crispy red cabbage slaw as well. But uh, what do you want, Alberto? Oh, why did I go so wrong? <laughs> yeah, this is way easier than using the, uh, the phone, even though the phone is the intended gameplay receptacle. I don't like it. Okay, we might as well do the slush while we're waiting, I suppose. We're not supposed to play games on the phones. It's wrong. It's a sin. It's an abomination. It's against nature. All right, so let's go, and if we need to stop it, we can do that, so that's good. How do we escape from here, though? How do we do a room escape here from the restaurant? That would be an interesting game. How's this doing? Is it okay? Yeah, it's fine. We can switch between the tickets. Yeah! I guess we could start on number two. Oh, yes, I need to bread it. I can't just put the, the meat right into the fryer. That would not be very good, would it? There it is. It's going there. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Ooh, 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 I'm edging the chicken. I get it. You know, how many times have we done this? Uh, come on, Alberto. What are you going to... Yeah, I thought that might happen. Yeah. Yeah, I thought that might happen. Wally. There's the mayo. Yay. And pickles as well. We don't have anchovies in this game. But that would really complete it. Um, we can actually start doing Wally's because look, he's got stuff first. So we can do the splodge and mayo at the bottom. How lovely. And um, we can do the picklers. Fudini, why have you been so nice to me, huh? What's that about? Let's stick that on. Let's get number fours going because it's the closer. Uh, yep, yep, yep. Papa's stuff. Sourced directly from Papa Louis himself. Milked this morning before he dashed off. What do you think? Why is my hair sparkling? Am I that magic? I'm a magical boy. Wondering why you got a low score. It wasn't low though, was it? Was it, you little prat? Was it low? No, it's 87. That ain't low. Do you think 87% is low? Okay. I managed to get through university getting 60%. All right, and that was the second best score. So shush, normal burn. And then the chicken, is that centered? Oh, that looks pretty good. And then we got some kind of cheese, I guess this is. Yeah. Some strange cheese. Lettuce, nice and fresh, hopefully. Not like these most fast food chains where it's just damp and horrible. Now that should be nearly perfect. Yeah, they're waiting. I really slowed down at some point. Oh well, I'm sparkly. Freeze putt. <sighs> okay. It's fine, I mean, this is alright. It's just mini golf. I played plenty of mini golf flash games back in the day. That makes me sound old. Steady as she goes. Let's just sneak down this way, I think. Yes! Alright. We'll get a birdie. Perfect. And here we go, Fudini. I know you're in love with me, but I'm just doing these games for the furniture and the tips, alright? No other reason. Don't get any ideas. Whoa, that was. Oh, that was so close to greatness. Look at that. We could have done something there, but no. We just have to take another shot. That sounded like the Minecraft click. Hey, there we go. 
So, oh yes, we have the top and the trim. Yeah, I don't like the green. I want to change the green. Oh yes, muddy brown. Perfect. And then we'll do harvest time. And a spicy, if anybody uses this. Hopefully Ember comes in. Stares at the wallpaper and goes, Yeah, those jalapenos did taste good. The poster told me. Okay, so we've got this silly thing. Oh yeah, stripes and stripes looks great. Man, these chicken pants really itch. Oh, M letters back. Mm hmm. That is not a biscuit. Oh, Claire, and you have a golden envelope for me. Hmm, a special. What could the special be? Chicken. Oh, we should start number one slush. Keep forgetting about this. You really do want to start it early because it takes a while to blend. Let's get number ones out and then we'll tend to ember. It's fine. We'll fan the flames. Oh, very nice. And then you thought I should play this on mobile. <laughs> no, I was getting like 50% on mobile. It was terrible. All right, that's ready. Ember's ready. Check, 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 check. Oh, okay, that's slightly over, but it's fine. Kicking chicken. Great. It kicks you. The chicken kicks you. And then you cook it, and it feels like you're getting some, like, satisfaction. Because, wow, that chicken had the audacity to kick me. But now I'm eating you, chicken. You fool. We'll be doing this game the same way as in Mokura as well. I'll be doing the no holiday section in this video. And then any holidays will be their own videos. Alright, so we've got to do... We've got two at the same time here, which is... I don't know. Let's just do number threes, because I'm getting a little bit lost. Why do I feel so lost? That's really overdone. You're going to get another one, because you're the closer. I don't really want you to get an overdone chicken. Very dry, very nasty. Well, you understand, I just had to take some extra time on Wally's order, don't you, Yuko? You don't want Wally to be upset. That would be very mean of you. Alright, let's do this before this gets too far. Crispy Wally, you're looking older than ever. Wondering why you got a low score? I don't like... Look at this. This is a precision nozzle. This is a splot, alright? That's a splot, because it's quite thick and viscous. You know, you could put that down while you're inside. No? Okay. Maybe I can use that. I can use that parasol as a screwdriver to get through the door. Yeah, I don't know. I, I, I don't know about that one there. Hey, I used a toilet seat as a hammer once. Oh, fashion flambe. Anyway, I don't mind this game. Here I am, look. Oh, I know what this says. Because I like anime. Uh, so it's it's red with the, the writing. White. That one, I think. That's a look. That sure is a look. This is odd. Brown and yellow. That's all I need to know, really, isn't it? Brown and yellow. Brown and yellow. Look at that. God bless America. Oh, we got more brown and yellow, but this time we got a wintry look. What was the shoes? Ah, it's got to be that. It's all matching, right? It's fashion. I, I didn't give him... I forgot to give him pants. Kicking chicken, not chicken kicking. It's not fable. It's a croissant with barbecue and hot chicken and jalapenos and bacon and barbecue and cheese and Chuck will probably come in. It gives me 150% points. Oh, that is something. Is that the next holiday coming up then? Oh, it is. Look at that. Starlight is going to be the first holiday. How patriotic indeed. But I'm saving up for some kind of alarm, you know. I think the slush alarm actually is what I'd like to get because it's very easy to forget about that. Chuck. No, it's Rudy. Okay. Chuck. No, it's Sweet Tea Slush. Okay, what? You're combining two different games here. Oh, we got Coconut Man as well. He's here. So he wants Fiery Breast. We all like a Fiery Breast. Alright, who else is here? Ember's back again. And you want the kicking Chicken. Well, you would, wouldn't you? Off she goes. Wee. Alright, so... Uh, first of all, we just need to know that we're doing this. That's an important step. So here we go. Oh, it's only a bronze. What a shame. Well, life is hard, isn't it, Ember? What a tragedy. Okay, can we get number twos nice and done? Because I've got to keep looking at this. Then we got the jalapenos. Then we got bacon barbecue cheese. All right. Easy to remember. Do that. We'll start on Foodini's. Before he doesn't love me anymore, he might not. That'd be very sad, wouldn't it? Then you start rigging the mini games. We already had one failure, so maybe that's enough for him to lose his love. And number two is ready to go. Extra tips, right? Extra points. 150% points. Yes, there we go. Tips is the same. Patrona. Still don't know what you're about, but you're a closer in this one. Why is everybody having veggie chicken burgers? What's going on? 
Guys, we have tons of chickens here. Did you see the thing at the start? We have tons of chickens. Oh, it's not perfect anymore. Oh, what a shame. 3% waiting. Feeding is like, I love you, but you let me down a little bit on this one. Why is it all this like corrugated iron? It's so terrible. And look, it opens up to put in the trash. Oh, Papa, what are the standards? Okay, we got strike out again. <sighs> oh, I'm sorry, fictional, not real Papa's character who's just made up to serve for Fudini's mini games. But you must be defeated. Or Fudini's love will wither and die. What is this bouncing? Can I have something better? There we go. Are you trying to mess with me here, hmm? Arm? My throwing arm is not quite what it used to be. Oh, it's very red, white, and blue in here now, isn't it? Red, white, blue, and brown. The colors of America. Uh, Lance, what else have we got? That's a bit better. Seriously, that tie does make him look like he's some protagonist. Why are the girls all over me? God, the girls just love me. And the boys. All right, let's continue. Oh boy, I wasn't expecting this. It's the delivery. It's time to hire some help. Who am I doing then? Who's meant to be next? Uh, oh, it's Jim Allen. Yeah, it's Jim Allen now. Jim Allen, Dave Bob from Sushiria. There we go, Jim Allen and his mighty sideburns. Warm are wearing this ridiculous chicken outfit. And he's really complaining, of course. Wouldn't be our favorite British person without some complaining, would he? There he is, Jim Allen Dave Bob is joining us. Ha, huh, you look ridiculous. Oh, here's Coily. Hey, she's from Sushiria too. Fish, sushi. Yeah, I brought some, uh, brought some of the Sushiria stuff with me. Hope you don't mind. Hey, that's fine. You still look ridiculous though. Yeah, you better watch your mouth, boy. And cut your hair as well. My hair is beautiful. Okay, you're just jealous because you're going bald, old man. So she wants the uh, the fish stuff. Drag the tray of meats. I love trays of meats. Here's the fish. What are we doing on this hot? We have a rhombus of fish. And the phone is ringing. Of course it is. Oh, it looks like it's Wally. I'm not an old man, all right? I'm in my 40s. It's not that old. So Wally can't be bothered to come in anymore. His old bones are a bit too brittle, hmm? Wally now wants the fish, of course he does. Off you go. Oh, I forgot to check the uh, Wally's meat. Why are you not checking his meat? Come on. That's the first rule of being in one of these restaurants. Don't you know anything? Oh, we're fine. You don't trust me, Jim Allen, huh? Yeah, as a matter of fact, I don't. But I mean, I guess you're an improvement over that alien I had last time. I just don't like having to answer to people, you know? Might get a little stabby. All right, I'm gonna just pause that for a second while we take this order. Because Pally has been waiting too long. Oh, the bloody phone's ringing. Yeah, well, why don't you answer it? Well, I can't be bothered right now, all right? I'm sharpening my knife. Man, whenever Jim Allen's involved, is arguing. You just can't... What? How did it go so... Oh. I should have done it at the end. I'm not redoing it. And keep ringing, I don't care. Oh, come here. Oh, actually... Oh, he's at his apartment. From the first game. Oh, Quinn is back again. You come from work, right? You only get one day you can eat out or something because you're so busy at work. I think that was the law. As long as it's over 90, I'm pretty happy, to be honest. And now we need to start on Quinn's as well, really. Oh my god, I've done it again. See, this is why I need the slush timers. They're the most important thing, I feel like. Emlet, what do you think? Hey, I don't have to stab you. That's very good news for you. Think about it, if you stab our customers, who are we going to serve? I don't care, I'm just, I've been pulled into this. I didn't ask for it. You know, there are more creative ways to get revenge than just stabbing someone. You could trap them in a room, for example, and make them solve ridiculous puzzles. You know, Quinn, you're actually kind of cute. Especially when you're a cat girl. I'd like to see that. Yeah, well, we're a bit of a way away from Halloween. Okay, slush is slightly overdone. But... What? But it was slightly overdone. Why is she... I guess she likes being complimented. <laughs> hey, here we are. We're outside. <laughs> oh, why is it spin and sauce? But just just why? There we go. I got the first one. That's easy. But I can't get the second one. I, it psychs me out, I guess. It shouldn't be much harder. Look how many I've got to do. All right, and I can't even get the second one. Look, look I can do it with my eyes closed. That'd be easier, right? When it goes... Ew! 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 Okay, it was still the second one. I legitimately did try and do it with my eyes closed. Food truck. Oh, this is where they introduced the food truck. You can send your driver out into a food truck between work days to make any food you choose. Fine, let's have a look. All right, welcome to Jim Allen's chicken food truck. So, 
I would put poison in it, but it's not really my style. Uh, I could put a blade. We're not doing any vegetarian bollocks, all right? We're just doing a proper chicken. Let's do Papa's special breading. Oh my God, it's just instant cook. Well, why don't we move this into the restaurant? This magical food truck we could really do with this sort of power in the restaurant itself. Might be an idea, just saying. Make anything you like during free play. Well, it's not gonna be a bloody biscuit, is it? So let's do a sesame. No, I don't want things on the bottom of the bun. I don't like that. Let's do the chicken. And let's do some spicy. Uh, a bit of bacon, that sounds good to me. A bit of bacon. Uh, a bit of jalapenos, yeah. A bit of lettuce. I think that'll be good. Oh, a bit of cheese as well. Yeah, there we go. I like the, the watermelon. Let's go with the watermelon. Maybe a bit of cherry. Does that work? Boom. I mean, it's a good colour, right? But we've got a nice gradient here. I'm thinking about colours. See who shows up to buy it. Oh, I can't wait. Whoa! Who is that? Well, she gave me 100%, whoever it is. <laughs> Thanks, you. <laughs> you won't earn any points to increase your rank while at the food truck, but you can experiment with any kind of foods you like. It's kind of like they're giving me a way to do the messing up day. In some way. I'm actually going to do the messing up day normally for this video anyway. Because it's tradition, right? I want to do it for every game. But still, we got some potential here. Nothing happens, right? This is just, it's literally just a free play. It's just a sandbox mode, so. Julep, wow, she's kind of cute. Watercress, wow, that's kind of cute. All right, Julep, oh, she's just constantly like, ah. And she has an envelope for me, and she has watercress, and then tomato, and then the chicken, and then that stuff. And I'm gonna sneeze. <coughs> oh, sorry about that. I got a virus, I got a real bad virus. I might be dying. Don't trap me in the hospital. I don't want to escape from a hospital. Cress of water. There's tons of ingredients in this game. Absolutely tons. We've already got quite a lot. <laughs> and there's not even a holiday. Might be a little messy, might be a little lopsided, but it's fine. What do we get for that? Buffalo bacon biscuit. Well, I don't want it. This is taking its toll on me recording this. You see what I sacrifice? I, I'm not feel well. I don't want to answer the phone right now. Sorry. <laughs> Nobody home. Nobody here. Yeah, very nice. I like your hedge. Fine, fine. What is it, Toro? Pap. Are you calling Papa? Because this isn't his personal number, okay? If you wanted an autograph, you're not going to get it. Yes, ever closer to whatever mediocre mundane reward I get from that. Oh, I got a sticker. Doesn't help me. Go away. Rico, it's Rico. Oh, you're a closer again now, huh? Hmm. I don't have any chili topping, at least not yet. It's way easier on the down than it is on the up, I feel like. I don't know why, it must be a psychological thing. What does that say about a person's personality, hmm? What personality type are you? Are you the campaigner? Are you the virtuoso, like me? <laughs> Another sticker, I don't care. I do not care about your stupid stickers, okay? Stick them up your ass. Oh, uh, don't you mean your ass? No, I mean their ass. Look at this, you see this? This is American, all right? You're trapped in here with me. Why do you feel so trapped? Because you are. Anyway, look, it's Pizza Pachinko. I remember this time. Yep, see, I remember. I remember. Now this one I do not remember whatsoever. But it's not that. Why do I never remember the second one? Like, I don't remember where I'm supposed to put this one. You'd think it would just be hit this, right? But I keep hitting the... Oh, sh where, where are we going? Okay, it's terrible. Jim Allen probably doesn't want to wear all that stuff. You go back to that, Lance. That will separate you two a little bit more. We have the Buffalo Bacon Biscuits, the BBB. Uh, it's two times tips, but... As usual, I like to finish off something before I start another one. I'm getting slush along two because I use the right slot more, so slush along two. Ah, Dia de los Muertos instead of Halloween. Well, that's nice. That's a little different. Oh, Sasha. She's kind of cute. So we now have... Should have a timer on this. Yep, there it is. That is indeed a timer. Oh, Kenton. He's kind of cute. Shut up. I'm on the phone. Uh, what do you want, Kenton? Uh... And how can you see him anyway? It doesn't make any sense. And nothing makes sense here, Jim Allen. Surely you're used to that by now. All right, so we're starting off with the cheese. Oh, good old cheese droop has returned. It is burger rare. Really is a spiritual successor. Anyway, Alberto's been waiting. Oh, he's pretty cute. God damn it, lads. Keep it in your pants. Hey, keep your lads in your pants. Oh, what is this? 
Oh no, okay, the phone's gonna have to wait because... I mean, being on hold like that is probably worse than coming into the restaurant and waiting. Just play some nice boss and over and they'll be fine. Now I'm going to take the call. Here we go, look. There you go, Doan. Hope you enjoyed the music. Uh, I cooked it incorrectly. I did something wrong. I did the wrong breading or something. Ugh. Uh, he was still happy enough. Oh, we don't even have the slush going on this. Oh, no. Bad, bad times here. Oh, sloppy. Who is it? Who is it? Oh, it's Moose. Now, last time, Moose, you were very nice to me and you gave me a perfect. Will that continue? I don't know, because today has been a little bit strange, I'll be honest. It's been odd. Hey, Moose, it would have helped if I called you kind of cute. Instantly delivered to Doan. Why? How did I mess it up again? What am I doing? We have to have a difficult day, so we appreciate when it goes well even more. Come on, Moose. Give me something. Oh, the waiting. Right. Look at this stupid thing. Look at it. Well, what can you do? This little duo, they had a little bit of a disaster. Hey, it wasn't my fault. I was, t I was answering the phone. Watercrest Wrangler? Yeah. You're like a couple of bits of watercrest that I'm wrangling you to. Oh, a slider escapes here as well. Yep. 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 And that's slider escape. So yeah, we'll do the messing up day now because I think it's time. Look, there's some beer. Drink that. Get drunk. Don't worry about it. And this matches the holiday because it's the red, white, and blue. A starry fence. Yeah. Okay, so let's do a normal quitting day even though if we do any more silly recipes, we can do it on the food truck after this. But for old time's sake, proper quitting day. It's the new holiday. We'll see this properly in another video. And Marty's here because he's a true patriot. And smoked cheddar bun. Are you ready to get America'd? Yeah, I'll give you America. Alright, so what do Americans like? They like patties, alright? And they like ingredients where you're not quite sure what's in them. But they eat them anyway. Cheesy bun. Oh, oh of course. This can be the cheesy one. That makes sense, doesn't it? Let's do a slush as well. What's the most American thing here? Apple? Uh, yep. What is it? Oh, I don't really want to be here today, but just, just tell me. I really wish I could just do this, but what I can do is get the, <laughs> get the dip really, like, look at this. That's not good. That's really not good. It reminds me of Wingaria. We put that on, right? Oh, it's done. It's a raw chicken, but it's covered in batter, kind of, so you don't even know. We'll do a large lemon, really poorly done, really poorly poured. Now to business. We have, not that one, this one, the American one. This kind of cheese. This kind of cheese. Yes. And bacon, of course. Oh, it's not letting me do any more. That's a shame. Well, I guess it's a cheesy one, isn't it, then? That's what we have to do. That's fine. <laughs> oh, look at that. 27 slices of American cheese. There you go, Marty. I'm sorry you had to see us this way here. Now, number two. We'll do this uh, raw chicken, which I love to see. We can try and do what I was trying to do with the bacon, right? That will cover up the raw chicken so you won't notice. And you like pickles, surely. Who doesn't like pickles, huh? Scattered about all over the place. Who doesn't like leaves? I think that's as much as I can do it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, I brought it all the way here. How is that not even falling off? Look, it's clipped on the side down. You don't like that? Reality has been distorted before your very eyes and you're not impressed. If we're doing an everything one, we need one of these each breading as well, so. And then we'll do just another Pappas because I only have three breadings at the moment for the vegetarian option. There's Jojo, but you're just going to be ignored. Don't worry, Jojo. Let's get building. So we can't do all types of buns, but we'll do a seed bun. Uh, we'll do what you want here with the cheese, right? And then we'll do another cheese. Now we need to use our meats, right? So we got one meat. Okay, now we'll do something else. So what have we not done yet? We've done not that. Maybe we've got some of that as well, the red layer. Maybe an onion. Now we need another meat. This one. And you see, it's all going to come together very nicely. Look, we can save some space by doing that. Oh, uh, another meat. Yes. There's that one. Now I need some of the crispies and the, the slaws. And that's it. That isn't everything we can do right now. Holy moly, that's a stack. You're going on the thumbnail for sure. Uh, as far as this goes, we can't do an everything here, obviously, because we have to choose. But I can do... I don't know. This is a bit boring, but we can do, like, a vanilla. We can do some ice. Apple. 
Oh, just don't even bother sushing it. There we go. Like, hey, that's done, isn't it? Oh, you don't like it, Sasha, but you get everything. Everything you ever wanted. Oh, these are burnt. Oh, wow. They haven't gone... Oh, that's gone black. Wow. I won't even put your biscuit top on. This is a bit of a burger throwback as well. There we go. Very, very quickly done. <laughs> oh, you're choking. All right, now we just got Jim Allen. He's got to bring the last order that's going to be messed up. Don't get angry, Jojo. It's fine. Last order we're going to have here messing up. What can we do with this? Somehow it's never ending. All right, saucy one then. We don't need the meat at all. And cherry, and this is how we'll round it off for this video. Yep, yep, you're gonna complain. <laughs> you're just gonna have to wait. I wanna see what it looks like. Yeah, there we go, I think that's it. It's just a juice drink. <laughs> so we got a slop burger with juice drink. Cherry juice drink. All right, there we go. There we go, Fudini. You don't love me anymore. Oh, what a shame. Nothing. Well, time to leave. We can't be saving this. But let's have a look at the parade so far. It won't be that much, but there'll be something. Ah, there we are. It's Lance and Jim Allen. Look at Duke's little campy wave. Oh yes, hello. There's so many of these damn games now. But I'm sure I will return and with a stronger voice. And we'll see Starlight Barbecue and so on and so forth. But until then, thanks for watching. See you next time.